Okay, I'm in the garden to redesign it. Oh, what a mess. Okay, so this is pretty much going to stay right now because this is the celery root. So I'm going to leave that. I'm going to leave this first fencing here that's staying for next year. And these are all coming down. Okay, now I'm going to move one of these arches as the new entranceway. this beautiful dill. And beautiful cilantro about to bolt. And I'm going to pull up this fencing and create the space for next spring here. Ooh, I tell you, I did a good job getting these in the ground. <laughs> they are tough to get out. Okay, I got all the fencing up and I've kind of fixed up the soil a little bit. I still have some work to do, but these are going to be the two entrances. I should say the dual entrance, <laughs> those arches, because they're going to have beans on them or something, peas, something in the spring. And I put the basil here because this way they will get the morning sun. This is the east side of the garden. They'll get the morning sun and maybe the blight won't hit them so badly if they get the morning sun as opposed to where they were all the way down here not getting the morning sun and blocked by the tomato plants so that was not a smart design but it's redesigned it's ready for the spring i'm going to do a little more work to it and uh, hopefully next Saturday I'll have a nice little tour set up on what, what's going on in this garden and in the herb garden back here.
Thank you so much for visiting. Everybody have a great day.